In this video, I will show you how to add email validation in Webflow. Currently, when a user fills out the form's email input with a value that doesn't look like an email, it still goes through. To start, go to the Designer Page Editor. We need to implement a custom attribute on the email input field, which will help prevent random values. Select the email field, then go to the Settings tab in the sidebar. Scroll down to see the custom attributes toggle. Now, add the pattern attribute, and then the regular expression, rejects value, which I will explain later. Finally, add another attribute called title, as a tooltip message for when the user inputs invalid values. Now, publish the changes and test it. As you can see, it is working as expected with the validation tooltip showing. Next, try adding .com to the email value to test further. We've successfully implemented it. Okay, let's explain the regular expression that we added earlier. This marks the start of the string. This part before the at symbol allows letters, numbers and these special characters one or more times. The literal at symbol separates the local part from the domain. This is the domain part before the final dot. Allows letters, numbers, dots, and hyphens one or more times. This one matches a literal dot, separating the domain and the TLD. Next, this part is the TLD, like dot com. Must be letters only, 2 to 63 characters long. And finally, the dollar sign marks the end of the string. Thank you for watching my video.